What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. Today, I just wanted to discuss a topic. I got the episode number wrong, but I got it right today. Today is number eight, the number of opulence, the number of abundance. And I see a lot of that coming this year, but right now, I just want to talk about one topic where it's hard for people to grasp this, especially in situations that feel hard to uh, maneuver through or hard to kind of give yourself the platform of being the most important thing of your life. Um, so when you're in a situation, say a relationship or a um, an environment or you're part of a team and you have to give a lot of yourself away, you start to lose sight of yourself you know you, you kind of start to put yourself into this self this self-sacrificing mode that oh well if i'm not happy at, at least these people are happier this person's happy you know um i think that's that's kind of a virus right now or it's always been a virus but i think that's that's a virus that that many people are uh, infected by you know they start to give away their freedom for such a small price. And I don't want to undermine anyone's situation because I don't know what I don't know what people are going through and I don't know how hard these situations are. So I, I wouldn't say a small price, but they're giving away their freedom to some idea of, oh, this is the role I should be playing. So this is how I'm going to be. This is what I'm going to give up to be a part of this. There, there, There's this sacrificial mindset, essentially, that this is how everything should be. And today what I wanted to speak about was do not sacrifice your freedom. The number one thing you have in this life, your freedom to make someone else happy. When you sacrifice your freedom, you sacrifice your happiness, your ability to be happy, your ability to not be controlled, to not be a puppet, to not be someone who is told what to do and when to do it. Once you give that up, you will never be that person that you wanna be, ever. When, some, when something outside of you has control over who you are, you will never be able to reach that level of resilience or discipline or motivation that you want to reach. You will never be able to touch that because somebody else has you on strings. Someone's controlling you or something's controlling you. Now, when you can detach yourself, that is the day you will be able to have all the opportunity at your fingertips. In any, in any craft or any endeavor or anything you're working towards, when you can break free from those chains of situations that make you feel confined and don't allow you to be free, that's when you can say, all right, this is, this is going to be a good ride. This is going to be something that I'm free. I can go here. I can go there. I can go. In, I can go there, but I can choose where I want to go. I don't let any circumstances or situations dictate where I move. I dictate where I move, and that's how you should operate in your life, Re regardless. You know, no matter what you do, that's how you should operate your life. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. I just wanted to make it quick. Just wanted to make a, a little vlog for you guys just to update you and uh, just to give you some words of encouragement because I really think freedom is the most important thing in this life. You're the most important thing in your life, but your freedom is also the most important thing in your life, if that makes any sense. Once you operate at, at a level of choosing to control what you can control, the possibilities are endless. The possibilities are endless. You cannot 
even fathom the opportunities that will open up for you once you decide once you decide that this life is yours i think we're all free to a certain extent but we just i mean it depends on your country circumstances but i'm saying the majority are in a state of actual freedom but they've put themselves in situations which have blinded them from the fact that they actually are free and have always been free but they're convinced they're they're blind you have to take the glasses off the foggy glasses and clean them off and realize that this is your life realize that this is your life and you choose where you want to go so where are you gonna go not to make it a dramatic ending but yeah thank you guys for watching